Ready. At this time, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to move on to our next question and answer phase of competition. She is first alternate to Miss Gay South. This is our 38th contestant, Miss Charity Case. I'd love to dance. Thank you. Good evening. <laughs> Good evening, Charity. How are you? I'm fine. I'm glad. This is the onstage interview phase of competition for Miss Gay America 1984. Didn't you get it? 84? Slow, people. I thought I was not. Very good. In 84, you were. This is Charity Case. She's going to do a brief biography for us, and then I have a list of questions, and I will give you a question to follow. Okay? Okay. Good luck. Thank you, Vicki. Good evening, ladies. Good evening, ladies, gentlemen, and judges. I'm contestant number 38, Charity Case. Thank you. My given name is Mark Coleman, and my brief biography begins on August 22nd, 1961. When much to the delight of my parents, Betty and Becky Coleman, I was born. I was raised on a farm and was a very colorful child, always searching for a stage to perform on. So it only seemed natural that after high school, I went to college and majored in the performing arts. After six of some of the best years of my life, I finally graduated with a Bachelor of Music in Vocal Performance. Around this time, I discovered I was not probably going to be the next Pavarotti, and so I decided I wanted to become the next Maria Callas. I saw my first female impersonation show at the same time, and that female impersonator was Melinda Ryder from Kansas City, Missouri. I looked up on that stage and I said, I want to be one of those. So two years later, I found myself here at Miss Game America, and it was in Dallas, Texas and I'm thrilled to be back here this year. For the past six years, I've resided in St. Louis, Missouri, where I work as a female impersonator and also as a florist. Thank you. Thank you, dear. This is your question. Miss Gay America travels 12 months out of the year. How would this affect your home life, and how would you deal with it? I'll read it again for you. Miss Gay America tra travels 12 months out of the year. How would this affect your home life and how would you deal with it? Okay? Thank you. I think that anyone who's here and is a serious contestant has given that a lot of thought. And I wouldn't be here on this stage tonight if I didn't know that I could handle the, the situation of, being tra of traveling for 12 months out of the next year. I've discussed this heavily with both of the, uh, my roommates that I live with and um, I think it would be a wonderful opportunity for me, and I think that everyone that I work with would work for me to be the best Miss America I could be. Thank you. <laughs> Ladies, gentlemen, and judges, this is contestant number 38, first alternate to Miss South, Miss Charity Case. Thank you, Charity.